Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another Strategy M video. Guys, you're probably watching this video because news just broke out that Bronny James, the son of LeBron James, actually just had a cardiac arrest. If you don't know what a cardiac arrest is, it's pretty much like a heart attack while he was having practice at uh, uh, one of his practice facilities. Um, just Googled him real quick, real quick Google search. LeBron James' son, Bronny, suffers a cardiac arrest during USC practice. So pretty much he went to the, you know, went to the hospital seems like he is in stable condition right now but i mean it's, it's big news for an 18 year old who's in shape who you know pretty much just reading some of this stuff we'll read it together so lebron james son Bronny, 18 suffers cardiac arrest during usc basketball workout uh the 18 year old athlete now in a stable condition and no longer in the icu a representative of the james family confirmed so he is the oldest son of lebron james who was recovering in a los angeles hospital after suffering from the cardiac arrest during a hospital uh, a workout um, yesterday while practicing, Bronny James suffered a cardiac arrest. Medical staff was able to treat him and take him to the hospital. He is now in stable condition and no longer in the ICU. We ask for respect and privacy from the James family. And we'll update media when there is more information. LeBron and Savannah, which if you don't know Savannah, Savannah is the wife, wish to publicly send their deepest thanks and appreciation to the USC medical and a athletic staff for their incredible work and dedication to the safety of their ads. So, I mean, guys, it's crazy because, you know, he, he's very young. He's 18 years old. He's in shape. Um son of one of the most popular people on the planet one of the biggest stars and when you're 18 years old you should not be having a cardiac arrest all right so even just going out to twitter with guys look at twitter's new logo it is the x which is crazy uh but let's just go on to trending so jumping on to twitter so we can actually see what uh is trending on twitter you can obviously see where is it it was just turning a uh, second ago let's look up look up brani let's see what they're saying yeah so he suffered cardiac arrest they're saying he was fully vaccinated against covid with many boosters praying he makes a full recovery young healthy 18 year old are not supposed to experience this so it's everywhere everybody's talking about it i mean it's pretty big news it's crazy he had a heart attack while in practice everybody here's jason tatum jalen brunson tyrese donovan mitchell trey young uh, Damar Hamlin, Magic Johnson. There's no video of it actually happening. Evidence that there's increased risk of myocardiac after taking the vaccine in early 2022. See what he says. See what this guy has to say. That are an anomaly, but nevertheless are incredibly possible. And so, you know, when you hear about this, if anything we've heard about Bronny James, we're thinking about an All-American. We're thinking about somebody that obviously has aspirations of being in the NBA. Uh, we've heard the great LeBron James allude to wanting to play his dream is to play in the NBA with his son, et cetera, et cetera. And all of that gets thrown to the wayside uh, when it comes to something like this, because um, if you know anything about LeBron James, anything at all, you can say whatever you want. People could be critical. People could say whatever they want, but nobody debates what a wonderful, loving father he is and how much That's he facts. loves his children, especially Bronny. Uh, we see Bronny everywhere. Uh, we see him talking about Bronny all the time. His wonderful wife um, and, and the mother and Bronny's mother, Savannah, first class all the way, just a wonderful human being. They've got a great, great family. And Bronny has never, ever done anything to besmirch or sully the James name in any way. He, by all accounts, is an absolutely wonderful kid that we look at and we hope the best for. And that was just as basketball, as a basketball yeah. player because of his aspirations and being LeBron James' son. When you hear something like this, you just thank the good Lord that the medical staff was there in attendance, that he wasn't practicing by himself with nobody around. That's true. Uh, that there were people there. I mean, it's it's just so crazy to see you guys. All right, let's see what else. I know what we're all thinking about Bronny's sudden cardiac arrest. Sadly, we will all be called conspiracy theorists for asking the question of correlation. This wasn't happening prior to 2020. All I'm saying. I'm trying to say, it's probably trying to say it's those COVID shots. LeBron James reveals that he and his family are vaccinated after doing research and things of that nature. I felt like it was best suited not only for me, but for my family. Wow. So everybody's trying to pin it to the vaccine. Is what it looks like. We've got the owner of this hell site attributing Brownie's heart attack to the vaccine an hour after the fact with no evidence. Yeah. I'm not sure. See what this says. There's a cardiac arrest during a basketball workout at UCS and was rushed to the hospital. Now, first of all, I want to say my thoughts and prayers are with Bronny. You hate to see this, especially with someone so young as him and with such a bright future. But one of the most troubling things that I've seen is in the comment section below of this Twitter post, a lot of people are starting to claim conspiracies talking about the jab. 
It's like, for once, can we stop talking about conspiracies? Can we stop, you know, thinking there's an overarching, you know, something evil and devilish about this whole thing? And just look out for a guy's health. I mean, that's true. I mean, I'm not saying anything bad. I'm just looking at the media and seeing what they're saying about him and seeing what the reasons people are saying caused it. I mean... Things do happen. I mean, unfortunate events do happen to good people. Bad things do happen to good people. So we're happy everybody's all right. And uh, hopefully he'll be on the road to a full recovery. And I'm sure they'll be all right. And uh, yeah. But let's also check out while we're already on the subject of Twitter. Guys, Twitter just got a brand new logo. It's CX. Our headquarters tonight. Got it. Holy smokes. Who is that? Runaway model is now going bridal after this video hits the internet. Was it her? Is it just her of her walking? What's so crazy about that? She not allowed to walk? Looks completely normal to me. I don't even know who these people. I I don't know whose people is popping up on my. What the hell is popping up on my page? Oh, he meets Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian. Yo. That's fucking Kim Kardashian, chat. What the fuck? Come, come, come on, record it. Fuck you, kill Kardashian. What? No way. Yo, what's good, bro? Say hi. You straight? Why you got that PSG on? It's, it's because I'm gonna meet Neymar first. At, we saw you at the line. So you not a Ronaldo fan? Look at the Ronaldo's my goat. Then put that on, then, bro. Put that, bro. Put that jersey on, bro. You gotta put that Ronaldo on, man. You gotta tell him that Ronaldo's a. Everybody. All right, all right, Kim. Everyone what about you, Messi or Ronaldo? Both? Both? Ronaldo's better. <laughs> what are you? What do you say? No, no, no. I, I, we had a great time at the game. I like both. You like so both? We're checking out the. They like you more than Messi and Ronaldo. This is crazy. Come on, bro. Give me a hug, bro. I'm over here watching this, like, hug, bro. We'll take a picture. Come on, take a picture, bro. Yes. Okay. Eee! Bruh. Look at that guy's face. Why is he making those faces? All right, y'all. All right, y'all. Have a nice one, y'all. That is so funny. What a funny video. Biden. Biden on the news. Biden on the news. Awesome. Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate. Coming out with old footage. Don't call it sprawl and brawl. He said call it strike. And for fighters, Check this out. Now. Yeah, Big. both guys prefer to keep it standing. Um, in fact, both guys uh, who had their last outing at UWC, uh, you know, used the, the, excuse me for using it, but sprawl and brawl tactic. Um, against uh, against guys who were looking for takedowns the whole fight. Yeah, and he made them pay for that, you know what I mean? Uh... Oh, I, I may have seen this before. I may have seen a video of him knocking this guy down. Non experience here. Both of <laughs> catching the leg, running him up against the fence. Yeah, both guys very even on experience, four years apiece. Uh, and both, as I say, coming from a striking background, one from boxing. Uh... Oh, yeah, I did see this video. This is the video I seen before. In square, Kavanaugh is down for the count, ref stoppage. I tell you what, that was pretty nice. And Andrew pretty Tate nice. out. All right, guys, uh, I do want to thank you for watching the video. This one was a short one, but I just wanted to release the news on what we seen earlier today. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. Go ahead and drop a like on the video if you did appreciate it. And uh, drop down in the comment section below what you want to see next. And I'll see you on the next Lights, Camera, Stratus. Thank <laughs> you.